Hi, I'm Lessa Logan. I'm here at my Pilates studio in Los Angeles, and today I have long back arms on the Cadillac for you. So this exercise is one of my favorite exercises to do, actually. It really was tough for me in the beginning of my Pilates practice. I was like Gumby, and I just felt like I couldn't control these springs. And now it's one of my favorite exercises to give anybody because most of us are like this all the time and we just don't know that our arms connect to our back. And there are so many exercises in the Pilates where you have to stand on your arms, but you can't stand on them from here in the elbows. You have to stand on them from the back. So if you've seen the reverse push through video, then you'll know I suggest you do this before you do that. Um, one of my reasonings for that is the bar is wider here than the bar is wider there. And so it can really help you open up the front of your body and connect to the back of your body before you go to a narrower uh, version of your arms behind your back and then have a bar that's swinging you around. Um, but if you're too tight for this, then I highly recommend that you're doing things like small barrel or spine corrector arms to really help open up your chest and really connect your arms to your back. You're doing your mat workout, like your double leg kick to really help open that up. And then you can come here. So this is probably not the first place I'd put you in the beginning of your session. But if you're warmed up, I'll definitely challenge and see where you are. Now, you're going to come kneeling for this one. And if you're brand new or super tight, you can have your feet off the back. But in your future, you're trying to be a little bit more away from it. Now, it's really easy to let your guts hang out. So we're not going to do that. Our knees are apart, and just like in our chest expansion, they're squeezing towards each other. So if you want to see what that looks like, you can check out my chest expansion video. But you're going to have your arms back here. You're going to have your knees reaching down, your center pulling up, and then no ribs out, right? Keep it all together. And then you're going to pull the bar to your back. Now, keep your elbows wide. It's easy to let them come together. We don't want that. I know there's more of a stretch when they come together, but you want them wide. You pull them to your ribs. You push them down to your knees. You reach them back, you lift it up, and you pull it in, right? So I'm just trying to draw a box. I had someone comment on this video when I originally did it years ago, and they're like, you're not drawing a box. I'm very aware that I'm not drawing a box, but you're thinking about it, right? It's the roundest box you can. You're reaching down, you're reaching back, it comes up and in, and then you reverse it. You reach it back, you pull it down to the back of your knees and up. It's not a triangle, but there are those, you know, rectangles where one arm, one arm, one part of it is a diagonal. I don't know what those are called off the top of my head, but you feel me on it, right? So you're reaching, you're coming up, and then what you're trying to do is stand in here. So a lot of people, when I first teach them this exercise, we just bring it in and we just go down and up, right? Down and up, because you would do this on your long back stretch on the reformer you would do this on the window chair it's going to help with your reverse push through then you can just go back and forth here it's like a reverse chest expansion of sorts and so both of those preps are really essential for doing what we just did which is like trying to draw that four part piece without your shoulders going up and all around and being able to connect your arms from way back here now a couple tips um, if you're struggling with this exercise, I really like to make it a leg exercise. So I just think, how much can my legs work right now? Because the more your legs can root into this Cadillac and hug together, the stronger you are, the better it is, right? So sometimes we think it's about the arms, but it's really about the legs. And it just makes the whole body work together and makes exercise easier. If you have questions or comments, please put them below. Make sure you subscribe to this channel so you never miss a video from us. And I will see you next time.